Hunt and Darton, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Tell me a little about, in, in any particular order, your, um, your, uh, your cafe. Well, it's here. It's in Harlow for one month. It's a pop-up cafe. It's art in the shape of food. It's an interactive uh, performance installation. Um, but it's also fully functioning, so we do serve real Sometimes. food and drink. No, we do, we do, <laughs> we do, we do. It works. It does work. Um, we are your hosts, we are the proprietors. I'm Hunt. And I'm Darton. Uh, so we'll be here every day uh, looking after you. And basically, um, you can come along, it's free to come in. Um, there's a menu for consumption, and there's also a menu not for consumption. So you can order performances and it's side a orders. Three course meal of performance. So if you're not full up of art, make sure you ask us and we'll deliver that for you. I hate to be a lazy journalist, but you can't fail to notice there's pineapples on your head. There is pineapples on our head, that's correct. We do um, like to wear the food. We do like to wear food. So, we, um, it's always matching with our dresses. Yeah. Sometimes we wear broccoli as well. And on really hot days, we might wear watermelon. Only on really hot days. Yeah. Any food, any food you would not wear on your head? Asparagus. It's not very dramatic. Yeah. So where have you been and how has it gone down? Uh, we've been uh, all over the country. We're on a two-year tour at the moment. And Good evening. It's, um, hello, welcome. We're just being interviewed at the moment. Thank you very much. Thank you. This is a pineapple, but yes, we will. You heard asparagus. What? Nice. Very nice welcome that's to exciting. It's a great welcome. Um, we have been that's to a personal invitation to his house. It was. It's a great welcome that's to Harlow. Forward. That's very forward. Yeah. Very friendly here, aren't they? Very friendly. Um, we've just come from Folkestone. We were in Folkestone for a month, so basically we're on a two-year tour at the moment. So seven towns in two years, and this is the sixth of seven venues. So um, We've done Cambridge twice, we've done Edinburgh Fringe twice. We've done Brighton. We've done Brighton, we've done Manchester. We've done Stoke. Definitely done. We definitely did. Stoke. We definitely did Stoke. Definitely. We've done Colchester. Colchester. Which one was your favourite? Oh, impossible. Impossible to answer. They've totally all been different they've all been good go. for different reasons. And when you did Edinburgh, done Edinburgh, was it like in the midst of the fringe? So yes, it was. In, it was. It was the fringe. It was, it was the fringe. Yeah, yeah we were um, located on St Mary Street, and we were open every day for the duration of the Fringe Festival. Yeah. Enjoy it. It was great. It was full on, but great. Always great, I love Edinburgh. Yeah, Edinburgh's good, and we're going back there this summer as well, so. So what do you hope that people of Harlow get out of your cafe? Um, we just hope that they come and uh, enjoy it, and feel that it's a place that they can just kind of have ownership over, and... And get involved. Get involved, basically, yeah. and have fun. Yeah. Ladies, thank you very much for your time. Thank you. Thank you.